But it's fun yeah. though. It's a good job to do this. And I, I get asked to do some weird things though. I got asked to perform at a circumcision ceremony. <laughs> yeah, and I went, sure, yes, no skin off my. Perhaps that's not the right choice. A <laughs> word. And I do a lot of TV warm-up as well. So when you go and watch a TV show being recorded, to bring out a comedian who warms the audience up, like Paul was doing, and like I'm doing, and we pass it on to the show. And I used to do that for a TV show you might have heard of called uh, Loose Women. You heard of it? Yeah. Give me a cheer if you like Loose Women. <laughs> exactly, that's the sort of people. <laughs> well done. I, I, you know, it's fun. It was a good job. I got the sack from that job. <laughs> did it for three years, I got the sack. And the reason I got the sack is I called, to her face, I called Janet Street Porter a cunt. <laughs> And when I did that, she said to me, I beg your pardon, which I thought was really sweet of her to let me call her again, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> so she's not all bad at all. She's not all bad at all. All right, I've just got a couple of minutes left. These are literally, literally brand new jokes. I'm just going to read these out if you don't mind. Um, it's going to happen whether you like it or not, so uh, get bored. If you don't like jokes, you are about to see the best clipboard you've ever seen. Check that out. <laughs> that, is a, that is a fucking belter of a clipboard, isn't it? I had all that from America. <laughs> That's true. They phoned me up and said, are you sure? Fuck right. <laughs> Ironically, they wouldn't let the one with Donald Trump go through. How fucking weird is that? Anyway, uh, so i just try some of these. Um, uh, is this romantic, right? At 42 years old, I'm still in love with a girl that I met when I was 19 years old. Aww. Yeah, I thought so, but my girlfriend didn't agree just because it wasn't her. <laughs> so you can tell the difference between a brand new joke, can't you? <laughs> yeah, it's all right, yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I go to strip clubs, uh, but it's not just to see naked women. I go to make sure the girls get paid to get them through college. <laughs> Some heroes don't wear capes, that's all I'm saying. <laughs> People get very touchy in this day and age with descriptive words nowadays. You know, I, for example, my girlfriend got across me the other day because I called a sex worker a prostitute, and apparently that term is no longer acceptable. But I'm just glad that she uh, stopped me at that point in the story, and that's what she was cross about. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that will work. That will definitely work. Um, I inherited 10 grand from my nan last year and she told me to spend it wisely, so I bought uh, 700 hours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's definitely got legs, that one, isn't it? It's a double ticker, that one, isn't it? <laughs> I was so hungover this morning, this is true, I was so hungover this morning that uh, I sat down on my sofa and went to put the seatbelt on. <laughs> That's just true. I have no idea why. So I fucking hung over was. No, but that, that's a tick. Uh, I'm turning into my dad uh, by I've started picking up litter on the street that isn't mine. Uh, the only difference is that uh, a judge told him to do it. <laughs> my dad always used to say to me, you've got to save for rainy days, which turns out that's the name of the stripper he ran off with. <laughs> Uh, I just hope that Kanye West calls his next child Fred. <laughs> it's not Fred West's daughter, is it there, mate? <laughs> Quite angry at that one. Fuck, I'm not sitting for that shit. My girlfriend is def I'm sorry, I'm sorry, my girlfriend is desperate for me to propose to her, so I'm gonna get the ring from Elizabeth Duke in Argos, then we'll see how much she wants to get married. <laughs> We'll just move over. Uh, my new neighbour moved in and his hobby is breeding koi carp and I don't think we're going to get on because my hobby is throwing plugged in toasters into ponds. <laughs> <laughs> I like going to visit my nan. Uh, we play Guess Who? Not the board, she's got dementia. <laughs> Ha ha ha!